here we go. I love it. The classic Bayo one on the side of the blue in the hands of Michael and Shadow BR walking the Bayo two skin. And again, already immediately, right? If you're gonna fall onto me, I got stage control. I'm gonna call you out for it. Already Shadow BR, I think, really now has to kind of open up and say, I can't do what I like to do. I have to now play my opponent's game as well. Exactly. And now it's one of those moments like, dang, this is what I was doing to people? Like, you kind of get yeah, to real. realize, like, you know, what what you're putting your opponents through. Okay, I like that test, right? I think I think the generic Michael, Michael did a good job at seeing, okay, let me throw out this down smash. I want to see here the witch time kind of bail, the air dodge kind of bail, and now you have your answer, and now you can call it out, and that's why this damage, this kind of rebuttaled answer is taking place. All right, big opportunity here for Shadow. Not full committing on that forward air. If you were just held full forward, that actually might have been a kill there. Yeah. Okay, watch your step again, right? Okay, wow, what a wait. I love it because it's true. Bayonetta isn't really landed until she is landed. Yeah. So, that yeah. great respect, I think. And, and a generic Michael did a good job at just understanding and waiting what the character can do possibly. Yeah, I would have liked to see a smash attack, but like, you know, grab was still good damage. Good yeah. stuff. Oh. What a tech! Oh, okay, what a, what a witch <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> what a bat's within. Will though find the stock for a generic, a generic Michael in the lead here. But here comes the up air. Yeah, in the lead for how much long? Because that back air almost was like a heat seeking missile. It was so close to connecting. And but Bandana with rage cause, does cause a lot of problems because the multi hits become right. a lot more inconsistent. If you get multi hit off a of witch twist, you just explode off the top. Case in point, I mean not quite a witch twist, but still exploding off the top. We got ourselves an even game here. Yeah. Going. It looks like it might be over with that the way that we had there. But Shadow PR did a great SDI in that moment. And now we're going to have an answer of his own. I like the weight and using the air dodge again. Like you said, frame two, right? Going to get a point one or two, depending on that situation. But got right out and was able to kind of contest here against Shadow PR. And I was racking up the damage with even more wishes and making it hard for Shadow PR to even land and get even to ledge. All right, but yeah, using that nair to her box shift and just kind of tap dancing right over. I mean, Shadow has the neutral on tap, I feel, but uh, Generic has just more conversions. Yes. Okay, watch your step. Here we go. Opportunity. That was actually the perfect oh, angle. Yup, yup, yup. There we go. The SDI was not there. It was a very predictable, I'm going to get out to SDI. Yeah, I was about to say, it actually might have been there. It was the checkoff's gun. It was the um, rage with the multi hit. Yeah. Sometimes they just pop out and just explode off the top. It's like, well, I died at 30 because you had yeah. rage. Because I was winning. If you held up, right? Like, yeah. you're probably going to go out there. I feel like the SDI was not there. But even the down tilt, it was at the perfect position to yes. really suck you in there. So you're getting hit not only by the wishes, but all of it. Yeah, amazing stuff right there. And shout out PR. I mean, had a chance to kind of warm up through loose side, playing a bit hot. So Generic had to kind of wait and watch a couple sets after his uh, winner's final set. So maybe we're seeing a bit of that start to come out. Let's see how the engine warms up on Generic's side here. All right, here we go. On the ledge, I like it again. Like you said, I feel like this fire into Shadow PR, this adaptation that he's so good at doing, makes it so easy for him to just answer back over and over, and even waiting for these air dodges, knowing and understanding now what is the habit coming in from the generic Michael. Yeah, I mean, the reason the habits of the set kills are starting to get closer and closer, and as the set wears on, Ew. I mean, it is the best of five, so it's possible that like, we're going to see some hard reads start to pay off in a big way pretty soon. So far, though, I mean, hey, Generic Michael still in that first stock. And when it comes to Bayonetta, if you got that first stock, that's all that matter. Love that hard hit on that back air. Not going to be enough, but that rage cooking and making things a little bit fiery. But these things are going to get a little hot. Steamy, any hit is going to start getting these hits. But you know that back air on the side of Shout PR has been coming out the entire event. This shark definitely did a quite a fight. That's going to leave a mark here on the last stock. Yeah, that back air. Bayonet is bread and butter at the low per high percent, and at the low percent, we see the down tilt with both players fishing for it. Bayonet. <laughs> <laughs> you remember people, like at old Smash Cons, people used to like, scream when Bayo got hit. It was just the funniest thing. It's great. It's great. I can't. I can't. Well, shout out to the voice always. Yeah. Okay. There it is. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> <laughs> She's so She's dramatic. Good. Oh, wait. Where are you going? Uh oh. Uh oh. BRB. Yeah, try to drop down, then uh, afterburner kick, I imagine. But then, like, there is a long amount of time where if you tap down in the air, if you side B, you will just get that. Yeah, right. And uh, you got to be careful when you're hanging on ledge sometimes, right? You got three seconds of being invincible on that ledge. Take your time. Look at the position. 
you might input something that you might regret in that case. And now we're up 2-0 with the side of Shadow PR. Let's see if he can take this home. I like the rematch on Smashville. I don't think that was the issue. I think it just came down that Shadow played so well. I mean, they're both laying Bale, so whatever counter pick is just a comfort pick For at this real. point. For <laughs> real. just like, you know, you can choose the locale, but we're both doing the same stuff. For real. Look at this again, though, right? Like, these, like the out oh, my Ooh. God, the Ooh. adaptation and the weight is just so clean. Dang. Shadow. Dang. So I have to point out, off the air dodge reads, that was actually a reverse, which was there as well, to mix up the SDI. That yes. was clean. Oh, I like, like again, changing the position, knowing, hey, when are you air dodging? When are you trying to counter me back? I'm going to make sure that I get this off you. Okay, opportunity here. How are you going to finish no this? Resources. No, no. no resources. No resources. <laughs> His reaction with the side eyebrow. Did, did, did that just happen? Look it did. It did. <laughs> My man is in disbelief. I'm in grand? Huh? <laughs> like.